Well, it is the final day of the Keeley Top 3 and we're gonna be closing it off with a little black box called The Filaments. You know, sometimes the guitar could be all about subtlety. You know, we have these little tiny boosters here, a little compression over here, just a little bit of chorus just to kind of open up your tone. But sometimes you just want to step on something that just makes you mean sounding. Just bolt, punch, right in the face kind of tones. Well, this is the box for you. This is the filaments pedal. And this pretty much could be the be all end all of all the high gain tones you're gonna need for your gig. This pedal is designed to bring out the meanness in any kind of rig you have. I don't care if you have weak vintage output kind of single coil pickups or high output humbuckers. I don't care if you're playing through a tiny little amp or a giant stack. This thing has all the EQ options, all the overdrive options to really complement your sound to make sure that you're saturating in the right way. It's not gonna overload your tone if you have something big and it's not gonna kind of over sizzle your tone if you have something small. Just a really well-designed piece of equipment to make you just sound like an absolute monster. So you can go from like vintage old school metal to like really modern kind of chuggy chug chug chug. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go plug in my Yamaha Revstar Pro with the tone specific rock pickups in it. I'm gonna go right into a deluxe amp by Fender and we're gonna go wake up this dragon. All right, so this pedal is all about the metal. So let's go put on some good old fashioned metal riffs. But before we do, let's go look at the layout here. Uh, we have the level, presence, gain, treble, bass, things we've pretty much seen already before. A uh, great way to tailor and sculpt your tone to your amp and your guitar. Body is kind of like a cabinet, really. If you have like a small 112, you could bring it up here, get like a bigger 412 cab sound. Or if you already have a big cabinet uh, and you want to de-thump it, just bring the thing down a little bit. Uh, we have a gain boost. We have a bright switch and last but not least we have a crunch switch and what that does is it gives us like a nice kind of rhythmic compressed sound or big open in your face kind of sound very very useful so let's hear what this thing sounds like this is my clean tone and this is the filaments with everything on noon Oh, that's nasty, very, very good. For our first tone, I wanna get like a really nice compressed and tight rhythmic sound, something that really fits in the band to create a big wall of sound. And I do that with the crunch uh, switch down on the bottom, which is a more compressed and a lower output kind of sound, but very, very sweet. I'm gonna put up the boost for just a little bit more guts, keep the bright switch off, uh, turn up the trebles, uh, keep the body high because, you know, we're using a 112 cabinet, so I want a little bit more woof. And let's go see what we can do with this little setting right over here. You'll see immediately that you can get all those awesome palm riffs, big massive explosions, and a big wall of mean to get everyone excited for your guitar. <laughs> For our next tone, we're gonna go for like a classic 
old school metal tone, something that's you know really good for solo notes and just sounds iconically mean, okay? Uh, all we're gonna do, very simple, is I'm gonna go turn the boost off for a little less gain, but I'm gonna put the crunch knob up. And what that's going to do is that's going to give us a, a, a really a, a more open sound. So it's gonna be a little less kind of like compressed and clunky, but a lot more kind of sizzly and kind of direct. And uh, when you do it right, you got something that sounds instantly familiar and instantly awesome. <laughs> For our last tone, we're gonna go just take it right over the top. We're gonna give you some bright, we're gonna give you some sizzle, we're gonna give you some punch and some gain. It's a really great soloistic sound. It's a really great metal sound and it's addictingly fun. And all you have to really do, turn up the bass, turn up the bright. That presence is gonna give you a little cut right there, right on the top that makes all those notes not get lost in the saturation. Very, very useful for just kicking butt. That is it, that is the end of the Keeley Top 3 Weekend. It was a lot of fun to put these together for you all. I hope you guys enjoyed them. If you haven't seen the other two videos, give them a shot. They're a lot of fun. Uh, my question for all my subscribers out there is, uh, of the three pedals I did this weekend, which is the one that you kind of see fitting in your board the best? It'd be really cool to get your perspective on that. Um, all that being said, I'll see you all soon. Take care and goodbye.